Is No Man's Sky's universe truly infinite? You may be surprised, but it's not a cut and clean answer like you might have thought. This game is obviously absolutely immense, and is by far the biggest game ever built. One of the main goals of the game is to give us a sense of how small we are, and how large the universe really is. Even when looking at these stars, which are several light years, which is trillions of miles away from each other, we can still get lost amongst them. We know it's huge, but is it truly infinite? Well, let's talk about how this game can even be so huge. Wouldn't it be terabytes of information? No Man's Sky is the first game that is almost entirely procedurally generated. Procedural generation is the process of creating the game world around you as you discover it. Before you discover a planet, it doesn't exist. The atmosphere, biosphere, geography is created by your computer while you're playing. The coding of the game creates the entirety of the planet as you explore it. When you discover a planet, a 64-bit number, a seed number, algorithms, and functions all work together to create the planet. Basically, math makes the planet. The developers of the game seem to use the words universe and galaxy interchangeably, but we should understand that they are definitely not the same thing. In the real world, there are hundreds of billions of galaxies, millions of light years apart from each other, all which together make up the universe. In No Man's Sky, there are 18 quintillion planets, or about 2 quintillion stars, but all jam-packed into one galaxy. When you reach the center of the galaxy, or later in No Man's Sky's existence, it's entirely possible to create an entirely new galaxy, or thousands, or millions, or billions of new galaxies, all with 18 quintillion planets. So where did this number 18 quintillion come from? Well, it's actually this number. And it's a big number. And it's 2 to the 64th power. We use 64-bit computing, which only allows for 18 quintillion different integer values. So what's most likely happening is that these integers correlate to a planet, which through some maths, creates the same planet every time anyone visits it. Obviously, this is super complicated and hard for anybody to understand, but what we do know is that there are only 18 quintillion different possibilities of planets, and most likely, that is the number of planets in No Man's Sky's galaxy. So that galaxy is not infinite. On the other hand, it's very easy to generate a new galaxy, so if you can travel to new galaxies, there'll be 18 quintillion new planets for you to discover. Those new planets, though possibly in different places, may be exact copies of planets from the first galaxy. So with all of that information, do you think there are infinite galaxies creating an infinite, likely repetitive universe? Let us know in the comments below, and of course, have a super duper delicious day.